welcome. I'm Susan Spears, President and CEO of the Fredericksburg Regional Chamber of Commerce. Oh my gosh, you guys, what an exciting day. I am down here on Princess Anne Street in lovely downtown Fredericksburg for the grand opening of Sprelly. Oh, oh my gosh. This is such a great day for everyone who loves business in the Fredericksburg region. Adrian, Casey, you're going to meet the owners here in just a minute. But for those of us who've been around more than a minute, we remember, we remember the Maiden Fred VA event in October of 2013 where really Sprelly was born. Oh my God, it was so exciting. I believe you guys were like the audience favorite that night. And they still are, are we right? They're still the Fredericksburg favorite. You guys, oh my gosh, this is really what small business in the backbone of America is all about, is watching the progression of a small family-owned business as it grows and it exceed, excels in our region. We are so excited. I could not be more thrilled to be here, and I promise you, I'm going to be buying all kinds of good, yummy stuff as soon as we're done. Right now, it is my absolute honor to turn this over to Mayor Mary Catherine Greenlaw, who's going to give them more kudos for getting this business rolling down here in Fredericksburg, Virginia. Mayor Greenlaw. Thank you. Thank you, Susan. Well, I remember, too, I remember going to the State Fair, Adrian, mm -hmm. and being so excited. I don't know how many years ago that was, but what's this booth here at Sprelly from Fredericksburg? Homegrown business. This is a success, a remarkable success on so many levels. But kudos to our homegrown entrepreneurs creating this wonderful business and it's perfect for our maker district yeah. this is just you know this is proving that we love entrepreneurs in fredericksburg and we will support them but i'm so proud of you all and i love the peanut butter in the morning i recommend the breakfast friend but the salted caramel is pretty good the white chocolate caramel is pretty awesome i mean you know you just can't do and it's healthy it's healthy healthy <laughs> no but seriously I, i'm i'm so proud of this wonderful business and it's exactly what fredericksburg is all about and as susan spears said Small businesses like this are the backbone of our economy. Absolutely, it's essential to the success of our community. So, congratulations, Thank you. all of you. Thank you. All right, I'm gonna say a couple things. We did it, yay. <laughs> Uh, I, uh, I have a list of folks to thank, so uh, if you don't mind, I actually make some notes. First off, thank you all here, the, the Chamber of Commerce, Susan, everyone. Uh, this is incredible. I appreciate this opportunity for the ribbon cutting and the official headquarters for Sprelly. Um, I do have a list, and on top of that list is a gentleman by the name of Bill Freeling. Uh, Bill is the director for the Economic Development Authority, and he... Uh, invented the first business plan contest in which I pitched the concept for Sprelly. And ever since then, every step of the way, he's been someone I have uh, looked to and chatted with. And when this space became available on Princess Anne Street, he was the first person I called. And that's when he said, before we do that, we got to talk about rezoning the place. So uh, that actually ties into guys like Jeff Bragg and the Planning Commission. These guys just let me talk and ask questions over and over and over again, and they answered every single one of them. Susan Ball and Brian Baker with the SBA, uh, every time we had an idea, hey, what about this, what about that, very helpful in uh, putting this together with us. Uh, the planning commissioners, zoning commissioners, guys like Adam Lynch, again, when this whole process for rezoning started to happen, uh, I didn't know what was going on and everyone is super helpful, it's just the power of this community. Uh, there are a lot of mentors and friends. We have uh, some friends with us here today. Uh, the Maxwell family, Valley family, they've been uh, our rocks here when we're unable to feed ourselves. We go over to their house in East, so they're incredible folk. Um, John Iconado, he's a uh, mentor of ours, and he's been somebody that I just went over to his home, and I got these ideas, helped me walk him through everything. Uh, Chris Muldrow, uh, he's a website guy with Ramble Type. He's, he's been a person since those business plan contests as well who's been very important to us uh, with Sprelly. 
And then, uh, well, I, I got to say, Alexander and Sons Plumbing. They were the ones who really helped us through some trouble here at the building. So if you're looking for a good plumber, you got to call them. Um, our landlord, the Disability Resource Center, Debbie Foltz, uh, Jeffrey Halber Hal Perrin, uh, a lot of these folks associated with the Disability Resource Center. Uh, my wife, Casey, serves as board president uh, on this amazing organization who help folks in the area with disabilities. Um, and then, of course, Mayor Greenlaw, the City Council, uh, when they said, we're doing this thing called Creative Makers District, uh, it was an opportunity to push myself to see what that meant. And I'm just very happy and proud to show off what we did here at the Sprilly headquarters. And then last but not least, of course, the three most important women in my life, my lovely daughters, Remy and Charlotte, and Casey. None of this would be possible if it wasn't for them, allowing me to be absolutely nuts and, uh, you know, <laughs> come on, that's a joke, everyone. <laughs> so this has been uh, such a terrific thing, and we would like to thank this community. This is really, uh, this is an absolute demonstration of what the power of a community can do. So thank you guys. If you're interested in open up business in Fredericksburg, do it. It's amazing here. Thank you. All right. Let's cut the ribbon. Hold the ribbon. Hold the ribbon. All right. Okay. You ready? Are we ready? One, two, three.